Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing okay. For today's video, I'm going to be doing something a little bit different to usual. This video is all about a charity hike that I and Holly did together. Um, it was organised very last minute, so apologies for the kind of chaotic footage, but I thought I'd bring you guys along um, and kind of, yeah, share what we've been doing for such an incredible cause. Because I filmed it so last minute, this intro is a bit like I filmed it a lot later um, than like when we actually did the walk. Um, so yeah, it's a little bit topsy-turvy in how we <laughs> how I filmed this. Um, but I wanted to kind of jump in kind of early in the video and talk about what we were actually doing, why we were doing it and why it's so important. So what we were doing was a 13 mile hike in the dark through the peaks. Um, just so you know, I'm not a walker. I did not dress that well prepared. I thought I had, but I hadn't. And um, yeah, I didn't understand how far 13 miles was. Um, it was, yeah, mm, interesting. Um, the charities that we were fundraising for was the Sheffield Children's Hospital, um, which I just love. Um, it's so important to me. I don't want to get all emotional, so I'm not going to talk in depth about it. Um, but yeah, really, really important to me, those sorts of charities. We were also fundraising for Wurlow Hall Farm Trust. Um, so this is a kind of a, a charity in Sheffield that helps kids from low socioeconomic backgrounds get into farming and get some experience, um, which is just incredible um, and we got to see some of the farms on our walk so it was just really really amazing to see some of the work that they do and uh, hopefully you should see some of that footage in this video so you'll get to see kind of what that farm looks like even though it was so so dark um, and then the final charity that we were fundraising for through this walk was Hark so that's for homeless and rootless at Christmas um, which is again a Sheffield charity supporting those that are homeless at Christmas um, which I think given the year we're having it's a very very important cause and I think one we could all get behind so yeah a lot going on I hope you enjoy this video and kind of the walk it was interesting and if you would like to donate to this cause then please check out the link below um it would mean the world to donate but also it would mean the absolute world for the people that get help from these charities so yeah i'll see you guys in a little bit So today we're going to go on a charity walk, it's 12 miles, we signed up today, <laughs> we're not prepared, um, yeah, I thought I'd bring you along, show you how it goes, so I'll give you some updates as it progresses and yeah, how are you feeling Holly? Um, it's called Step Into Christmas, that's the name of the charity walk. I'm ready to step out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It'll be it'll be good. It's for a good cause. Um we're bundled up really warm. And we've got snacks, we've got hot chocolate. There should be food halfway. We're gonna see how it goes. It's really far, but we're gonna give it our best shot, aren't we? Holly's been at a concert, she got home last night at four AM. Technically this five. morning. Five AM. <laughs> and now she's doing this. Yeah. Wish us luck, and we'll see you soon. Oh dear. Do you want me to light up your face? Hello. We're on the walk. We're on the walk. It's saffron. Um, it's going really well. 
How are you finding it so far? Um, not as bad as I was expecting. <laughs> my legs are beginning to hurt, but I'm alive and I'm warmer. I actually might unzip my coat. I'm really hot. I'm unzipping the coat. I'm a bit like I could do without. I'm drinking my hot chocolate now because it's obviously going to get cold. But so far, so good. Mm. I'm feeling positive. We listened to some Christmassy tunes as well, didn't we? To get, yes. in the, to get in the spirit. We did. Yeah. Positive vibes. Good times all around. See you later. I got from the walk and I thought I'd just give you a bit of a debrief because by the time the walk was over I was not in the mood to film I was so tired and um, I didn't get home till midnight um, and yeah I was literally just exhausted me and Holly were like oh we'll get McDonald's after this and by the time it was over I was like no I just want my bed I don't even want to eat I just want to sleep like I'm done um, and I literally had blisters <laughs> on all over my feet like I'm, I won't describe it loads because it's pretty gross but I literally struggled to walk for the rest of the week my feet were so so sore and like the muscles in my legs it was absolutely crazy um, I'm really proud that we did that I definitely think next time I'd like to do it in the day because it's actually really difficult to walk in the dark like we had the head torches on but I don't know it made me feel almost a bit like motion sick because I couldn't see I could only see what the torch was showing me um so yeah I found it really challenging to be honest but I'm really proud that we did it and I'm even prouder to say that you know we actually were able to do some good this Christmas and do some charity work I just think it's so incredible and so exciting and yeah I'm really proud of every single person that took part um, so I hope you've enjoyed this video once again if you would like to donate it would honestly mean the world I feel like I've told you guys before but all my subscribers all of you I absolutely love you and um, yeah you know if if you can afford to donating would mean the world but also you know it's a tough year for all of us and I, I totally get that we're all living our own challenges at the moment so you know you do you if you can donate it's incredible and um, yeah I hope you've enjoyed this video um, make sure to give it a like make sure to give it a subscribe and I will see you guys next time hopefully you're in the Christmas spirit now have a good rest of your day guys